Now, here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. And we're tracking some light snow out there right now. It likely won't be amounting to all that much throughout the course of the night, but any tiny bit of snow on the roads obviously could create a slick situation. Live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. We just got done scanning South County and you can see a layer of very light snow working its way across uh, the south coast of Rhode Island and even Massachusetts, but the visibilities are still pretty good down in these areas. So that's an indication that it's not a very heavy snow, probably just some uh, flurries to uh, at the very worst some uh, very light snow. The uh, temperatures outside right now. We've got 28 in Providence, Gloucester 24, Newport, New Bedford. Right now that 29 degrees. In fact, in Providence, we've got a wind from the southwest now at six miles an hour, making it feel a little bit colder. Feels like 22 and we've got cloudy skies just about everywhere except for the south coast where we've got a, a little bit of light snow. Temperatures in Smithfield and Providence, Newport, Westerly, all in the mid to upper 20s. Satellite radar picture showing a lot of blue across the northeast, but uh, a lot of this is kind of drying up. There's a little batch of snow working its way off the mid-Atlantic states as an area of low pressure is getting organized off to our south. That area of low pressure is going to be passing to our south and he's kind of slowly through the daytime tomorrow, giving us the chance for some snow showers really tonight, tomorrow and into tomorrow night, but not going to amount to all that much. Let's take a look at it with our neighborhood future cast starting right now into the overnight, some occasional snow showers into tomorrow morning and tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening just some very light snow once again trying to work its way in. How much? Not a whole bunch in our area. A dusting to at the very worst an inch. And that's not a whole bunch when you're considering it starting tonight all the way into tomorrow night. There could be a little bit more out across Cape Cod and the islands. One maybe some isolated areas to three inches. Here's your future cast for tonight. Temperatures bottoming out around 23 with some snow showers, patchy fog, few snow showers tomorrow morning, rising back through the 20s, topping out at 34 degrees tomorrow afternoon with still the chance for a few snow showers. Temperatures across the area in the mid 30s tomorrow afternoon with some snow showers kind of here and there. 33 in Cranston along the south coast. Best chance for seeing any flakes would be down here tomorrow. Up in northern Rhode Island, we're looking at temps to be topping out also in the mid 30s in Barville situation in Cumberland, low 30s there. Southeastern Massachusetts looking at temperatures in the 30s with snow showers kind of off and on through the day with mainly cloudy skies. Here's that seven day future cast. We're looking at uh, seasonable temperatures really for the next week or so. Monday looking pretty good. The sunshine will be back and temperatures will be a, a little bit colder than normal, but actually not a bad day at all, about 33 degrees. We are looking at some uh, cloudy skies on Tuesday, maybe a few snow showers Wednesday. Temperatures on Thursday with sunshine about 35. Looking at a, a mix for Friday right now. Next Saturday, it's like we'll be drying out 41 degrees with sunshine. So some seasonably cold <laughs> temperatures really throughout the week. Nothing extreme, nothing overly warm like what we had last week. All right, thank you, TJ. Coming up on Eyewitness News at 10, a 